Hello, my name is Atom, and today I'm going to be doing a quick review on these. I don't know if you can see the second one there. Okay, there we go. This is just going to be a comparison. I hope I don't get sued for copyrights, but this is going to be a comparison between McVitie's original Jaffa Cakes and the cooperative cheap. Jaffa Cakes, which I have not tried before. So, I'm just going to be seeing if there's actually a difference. Uh, the first thing you'll see is on this one, they've got an offer on at the moment. Usually it would just say Big Jaffa Cake logo. But, that's pretty cheap, so at the moment this is probably cheaper than this. Currently. Uh, the first thing I noticed is the box is a hell of a lot cheaper on this. It even feels slightly thinner and this one also feels heavier than this one these seem to flash around a bit more but first of all I'm going to try the normal one simply because they're so nice so I open the box out the packet and open it very tightly sealed, so if they won't go off, here's Jaffa Cake. Bit bashed because it's on the end. Very nice. Really like Jaffa Cakes. So, that's another one. Very orangey and quite a lot of chocolate. Although the cake part you can't really taste, it's just the texture. So, First thing I've noticed on here is that the packets in these are clear, unlike McVitie's where they're orange, and the packet also feels a lot thinner. Uh, these actually look a little bit smaller. I'm not sure. There's McVitie's, and there's a co op. Oh, they're relatively the same size. But the co-op one looks like it's less bashed up, although that could just be where the box has been. There. Oh. Mmm. That's actually... That's hard. It's not even out of date. It's just crunchy. Which is... Quite strange. Usually Jaffa cakes are meant to be soft and squidgy like these. But this is like a biscuit on the bottom with a cakey inside. It feels like a stale Jaffa cake. But I don't think it's meant to be stale. I don't know why I'm still eating it. I guess I just like Jaffa Cakes, even if they're stale. <laughs> well, after that taste test, despite the fact it's crunchy, it still tastes quite nice. But, see, hmm, let's just see the calories and stuff. Uh, uh. Ooh. There's actually a lot less fat in this. There's slightly more salt and sugars. There is actually more sugar in the cheap one, which I'm not surprised at because it's the cake part is actually quite sweet in that. But, um, I think after that taste test, I still prefer McVitie's, and these are definitely the ones you should get. But, if, for whatever reason, you like them slightly harder, or you just like cheap stuff, or unhealthy stuff, I think it's mainly for the cheapness, but this is the one for you. But, for everybody else, I think this is definitely will be, is, and always has been the better one. 
so after that rather long review now actually I hope this helps you in the battle between the co-op and McVitie's obviously McVitie's being the original uh, I hope this was helpful or enjoyable or you just like me eating Jaffa cakes and I'll see you next time bye